Hi everyone, welcome back to Cooking with Jamila. Today's video, I'm going to be making cabbage with chicken. This is my own way of making this, so this is my own kind of recipe. For the new viewers, welcome to the family, and if you're already part of the family, welcome back, welcome back to another video. By the way, I wanted to let you know guys that I have changed my YouTube name to Cooking with Jamila, from Jamila's time to Cooking with Jamila. This is because I want to keep my brand constant, whereby I'm making food and I'm putting out YouTube videos for food. I'm not a chef, I'm just a person who loves making food whereby I love sharing the recipes I've learned and I've lo I love putting out these videos, I enjoy this. I'm going to be using today. I feel like this is the easiest recipe one can make if you're looking for something to make for dinner. I have here three different ingredients. I have cabbage, I have chicken and onions. But in my cabbage I have different like vegetables. I have the bell pepper, the green one and the red one. I have carrots, I have chili and then I've marinated my chicken here in different, you can you can always marinate your chicken to your flavor. For me, I always use uh, spices, the mixed spices, and chicken masala, which is a, a specific one from Uganda, and that's it. If you want, you can add in some lime or lemon, whatever, just marinate it to your own taste. So you want to start with putting oil in the pot. The first step I'm going to do is to fry the chicken until it's ready, kind of. So I'm going to fry this chicken until it's golden brown on both sides of the chicken. I feel like golden brown is my to-go when I'm frying things. You want to fry your chicken until it's this golden brown. I'm changing them like instantly and I think this takes like around even not more than 10 minutes because chicken chicken breast takes short time to get ready if it's this in small pieces this is the chicken it's done frying so next I'm going to be frying the cabbage I'm adding in the onions at the same time. So my cabbage has been frying for like, I covered it and it was on heat like for the past five minutes and it's starting to get soft. Actually, in Uganda we eat cabbage like this. There is a, There are many different ways how you can eat cabbage. Like this you can eat it as a salad like when you're grilling food or something like that. But this one I want to make it a soft cabbage. So if it depends on how you want your cabbage but if you want it like a little bit hard then you can add in like different things like the chicken and the tomatoes right now. But for me I'm going to add in the tomatoes for now. And this is one of the ingredients I forgot to mention in the beginning, but yes, in your cabbage, you need tomatoes. I don't know if I should call it like cabbage stew with chicken. I feel like it sounds more cool to call it cabbage stew with chicken. I feel like the tomato gives the cabbage more juice and i'm letting this cook like for five more minutes and then i'm going to come back and put in some spices the next part i'm going to just add in spices these are mixed spices add in some aromats aromat is salty so i should be careful then this is some chicken masala and Royco. So 
so the next part is I'm going to put in the chicken I'm just adding in a little bit of water because I want my cabbage to get soft so I'm going to cover it and let it steam so you don't need that much water here is the finished product so here is the cabbage I'm serving it with rice and avocado I don't know if you know me I love avocado I eat avocado on everything but thank you so much for watching this video if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell